What's going on world? It's your homie Sensei Rip and I'm back again with another video. Today we got Corey Holcomb reacting to Gabrielle Union telling Boosie to come out the closet after being asked her thoughts on Boosie criticizing Zaya Wade. That's right y'all, y'all know how we do. Let's check out this clip and hear what Corey Holcomb has to say. Make sure to leave your thoughts and comments down in the section below and I'll catch y'all afterwards in my commentary. Listen. Bless her heart. Dwayne Wade woman. Mm. Oh. You talking about the older one? Because they just I'm now talking about up. Gabrielle Union. <laughs> no, but I'm saying that clip. You talking about the clip. The Which clip? The one where she's talking about homeboy. Who? Boost. That's how he said Boost. She calling okay, the homie gay because he called her son gay. So far, so good, you know. Sorry, Boosie. <laughs> Uh, he's so preoccupied. Yeah, he is. Very it's much almost so. like thou doth protest too much, little booze. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna look you at a lot on your mind. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's like that out there. It's like Zaya and Lil Nas X living his head. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> like, I like, what? It's like, sir. <laughs> um, something you want to just go ahead and tell us. <laughs> This is a safe space. No, for real. We can be your sanctuary. Perhaps that safe space was not provided for him. And I don't think he had a safe space. He did not have one. We could we yeah. could definitely tell. It's just, hey, it's a cold yeah, world. Me. Listen, man, you can't call people gay as a response for parading a little boy around that's dressed like a girl, Gabrielle. Gabrielle, let me tell you this. Your son dresses like a girl, and y'all... Mm. Give it your blessing. That's going to make people say things. Why are you acting like somebody is attacking you when you have sacrificed your child for the internet? The little boy all over the internet and dresses and lipsticks and all like, you think anybody gonna say nothing? Exactly. And now somebody got to be gay because they said something about it. Anything. Just like Lil Nas X. Mm -hmm. When you see this man, that doesn't that look you that doesn't normalize for us 100 types. Well, that ain't normal. We ain't gonna never accept that as normal. It's always gonna be looked at the way it's looked at, and we gonna speak on it, even though they trying to write laws where we can't even speak on it. Yeah. They be ready to take your show off the air for simply opening your mouth about it. Them people ain't right. And Gabrielle, you ain't right for having problems with the backlash with having a little boy dressed like he dressed. The mama got an issue with it. Did you hear that, Gabrielle? The mama of the little boy got an issue with it. Who are you? You were bust down from Hollywood. D. Wade and you both made for each other, if you ask me. He get down in the streets, you get down in the streets. I know um, little Damon Wayne Jr. Man, Damon Wayne Jr. told me the funniest joke ever on the airplane about when D-Wade was in L.A. and he smashed his girl. You know, Damon Wayne Jr. was dating that girl. D-Wade got pregnant out here. He went raw in her. And... Little Damon Wayne Jr. was telling me he really saved my life. <laughs> oh man! You get what I'm saying? It's like, yo, Gabrielle Union and D Wade, them freaks. But you don't, you don't put that off on no child and encourage him being no freak. What do you think that represents? With look at this boy, look at her. First of all, that's a makeup face, by the way. That ain't how she really look. I ain't saying she ugly, but that ain't how she really mm. look. Look at this little boy. Do you think this little boy should be allowed to parade around like that long as he ain't paying rent? That's how you do if you pay rent. If you pay rent, then you can do that. But if you allow a little boy to come into the ridicule game, as y'all have done, that picture is going to bring ridicule to that little boy. That is a little boy. Mm. And you got him thinking, Everything normal and what's your problem? No, no. Yeah, I, 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 I have to agree with you on that because I, I, I don't agree 
when they're young kids, they're kids. There's so much that they're still learning. They can't even process something this heavy. I don't agree when and parents I'll, when parents do this and they push it. It's, it's like they're I, this kid. Come on, man. Somebody say yeah. Boosie looks sick. He might be sick. Oh, bless his look, Lord. let me That's tell you something, man. We that all going through look. it, but Boosie is funny He's when he talk. Always <laughs> had that look though. Well, let's talk about it, y'all. That was Corey Holcomb reacting to Gabrielle Union telling Boosie to come out the closet after she was asked her thoughts on Boosie criticizing Zaya Wade. All right, now again, if you want to, you know, see the whole video, because of course, Corey Holcomb had a lot more to say, make sure to hit the link in the description, but let's talk about it, y'all. You know, a couple days then came and went. People are still giving their take or their opinion on this situation. And like I stated um, in the previous video, when this, you know, first went viral, you know, Gabrielle Union and, and D-Wade has always been under a lot of criticism, especially the moment uh, they decided to let their son become the face of a movement, right? Um, and that's the part where, you know, it becomes a little conflicting as if, like, Gabrielle Union, you being a celebrity, an entertainer in a public space, a public figure, you have to be mindful of the criticism and the backlash that comes with those position and titles you know you uphold in Hollywood or just in the entertainment business you know this is why me myself I wouldn't allow my child to be a face of a movement you know in their teens it's just it's too early in my opinion you know what I mean to even have my child exposed to something like this because it could get out of control you know and at the end of the day we should allow our children to grow and evolve and you know becoming the adults they should you know what I'm saying? Only on its natural course. All of this exposing them to lifestyles and certain ideologies at a young age, I'm not with that, you know? And secondly, you calling out a man and his sexuality on a public platform can, of course, you know, create more conflict with Boosie. I don't necessarily agree with men going back and forth with, uh, you know, other men's wives, but in this case, Boosie has a right to defend himself. Now, again, Boosie's done faced many a criticisms on his ideologies when it comes to raising his children. We already know that, but the point is, you know, this can't be the first time you heard Boosie or many others, you know what I mean, on these platforms criticizing you and D-Wade uh, parenting when it comes to Zaya, man. But y'all let me know, what's your thoughts on Corey Holcomb? You think he went a little overboard? Uh, do you think he said exactly what needed to be said. But that's all I got for y'all today. My name is Sensei Rip. Till next time, peace.